Hey guys, in this quick video, let's take a look at the uh, chisel brushes here in uh, ZBrush. So what I'm going to do is go to Lightbox and I'm going to select something like DynaMesh 128. And you know what? I'm going to uh, crank up my resolution to 512, control drag, make sure my uh, resolution kicks in and you can see it's nice and dense. And uh, now if I go to my uh, brushes and select something like this uh, uh, chisel creature, um, I can uh, quickly create a fun looking character without uh, much modeling at all. So let's grab something like this ear one. I'm going to press X to activate my symmetry and let's drag out a big ear right, right there. And let's give him, why not give him some uh, horns? Maybe, how about this guy here? Give him a couple horns. And we could even give him an eye. So here's an eye too. I'm gonna grab this eye too. And maybe let's redo this part. Maybe give him, can give him mean eyes. How about, or little eyes whatever you uh, want, but just simply drag it on. And now let's maybe grab our move brush and just kind of drag the chin out a little. Maybe if we wanted to, we can even grab our pinch brush and just create maybe uh, something more angular. Let's redynamesh and now we can maybe hop into this other one called chisel 3D and let's look at some of our noses that we have here. So maybe let's give them, how about this pig nose? I'll grab this pig nose. I'm going to press X to turn off my symmetry and just drag, give him a pig, big uh, pig nose. That looks really uh, awesome, I think. And if we wanted to, we can also grab our uh, Dam Damien standard and maybe let's press X to activate symmetry and just give him kind of a mean, mean face, mean uh, mouth. I'm going to grab the bottom of this. lip here and just give them a big lip. So you could see how in a matter of seconds we created a really cool uh, character without pretty much not doing much of anything. So take uh, advantage of these chisel uh, brushes in ZBrush and have fun modeling. It could be a great uh, addition to something that you're already sculpting or maybe it's a good way to jumpstart a base model for you. All right, so thanks for watching.